Hey, God bless you, my friend and sister Sharon. And today we are discussing why many followers of Jesus Christ do not have joy and peace. Why? Because Jesus told us in Matthew chapter 5 and 9, he said, blessed are the peacemakers. Friends, I need you to follow me today. In order for us to be blessed, and that word blessed means to be happy or to be joyful, you cannot be that when you do not make peace with yourself. See, many people, we, we keep hearing to forgive others, but masses of people cannot find it in their own hearts to pardon themselves from all of the vile, wicked, evil things that they have done, whether you cheated on a spouse, whether you were in some type of serious sexual perversion, whether you were stealing and didn't get caught. Some people have murdered other people and didn't get caught. There are things that people are carrying, secrets, and it is destroying many people because unless you understand you've been forgiven, you are not living. You are not living, friend, until you learn how to make peace. Jesus said, blessed are the peacemakers. You, you cannot have peace unless you make peace. And you can't make peace until you first understand you got to be the one to make it. <laughs> it's like soap, friends. We, um, at Motivating You to Win, are now extending Outreach to making soaps, one soap at a time for hope, soap for hope. And in order for me and our team to make bars of soap, there has to be a chemical process that takes place, most notably with our handmade, this is a handmade all natural bar of soap. This, this soap was mixed with virgin olive oil, chamomile, and other natural ingredients. But in order for us to get it to this, no chemicals whatsoever, all natural, we had to mix lye, most uh, commonly known as sodium hydroxide, with, we had to mix that, which is a powder, lye, sodium hydroxide. We had to mix it with oil. And once the lye or the sodium and the oil make contact with water, because listen, friends, when you mix sodium hydroxide, which is an alkaline, it is very acoustic. When you, when you drop this or water into it, it reacts violently and it begins to fuzz and fizz and it can be very dangerous. Nonetheless, with the mixing of the oil, follow me closely, my friends. When you put that oil with that lye, it begins a, a chemical process that is called saponification. Saponification in its etymology means soap making. The, immediately soap is being made when these two um, uh, alkaline and oil come together. Friends, when we truly repent and, and confess to God what we have done. Forgiveness takes place. And God is saying, many of us don't understand that we receive forgiveness by faith. Soap has been made. And it's time to allow the washing of the blood of Christ to wash over you and to continue to walk out by faith that you have been forgiven. Friends, without knowing it, you cannot go but so far with the joy of the Lord because you will not make peace with yourself. It's like soap. You got to you got to you got to mix this stuff together and make it. That's right. We had to do some mixing to get this all natural bar of soap. We got to we got to do our part. And God is saying, "Come on, let's get some saponification going here because that's what's missing in your situation is forgiveness of yourself. You got to make peace 
with yourself. You you may have cheated on your spouse. You may have done some things that was just dirty, rotten, and foul. But who hasn't? I'll raise my hand. We are all guilty, my friends, of, of sin and, and dark uh, 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 things we've done. We don't even want to talk about it. We don't want to even think about it. So friends, let's get to making some soap in the spirit because you can only go so far when you refuse to forgive yourself. When you refuse to by faith, you are not that person you, you, the thing that you may have done, that's not who you are. That's something you did. It's time to let it go. And remember, as I stay in military garment to illustrate, the battlefield is in the mind. And you and I, we have to, we have to allow the, the oil of the spirit, the truth of the matter, you have been forgiven. And it's time for some of us to truly start living. He or she that has an ear to hear. The battlefield is in your mind. God bless you, my friends. Make peace. It's time to make peace. God bless you, my friends. Till next time.